Fraser, congratulations on putting pen to paper on the new deal that will see you tied up to the club until 2023. How does that feel? Uh, it feels good to know that I've got that and feel, feel happy I've got it. So i look to kick on now and hopefully start playing games soon. What was it that, that made you want to sign the contract here? What was it that, that made Hibs sort of feel like the right option for you at this moment in your career? Uh, been here, been here for a while now, and uh, seeing like Ryan and all in that play games shows there's a chance uh, for young players to play here. So hopefully, I'll get some. I'll be next, hopefully, and uh, just keep working hard, and hopefully it comes. You are obviously in the manager's thoughts. You've been involved in the first team squad this season. You've not played though for for over a year, but he has trusted you to start matches before. And you know, what did the manager say to you about the new deal that was offered and about your progression as a player? No, just to, just to keep working hard and just it's basically said uh, if I keep working hard, you know, that so he'll give give us all, give like all the young boys chances and that if be doing what he can trust us. And I said again, he's trusted Ryan, trusted all the starting games. So it's just basically that said, keep doing what I'm doing, keep working hard, and a uh, chance will be there. How good is it to have a manager who is? so trusting of young players and uh, putting them into high pressure matches? Uh, it's good, you see like young boys playing like big games against Hearts, Rangers, Celtic and that so you don't see many other managers in the league do, uh, do that with, with other young boys so it's good to see that the manager here likes to do that and trust, trust the players as well. Just in terms of uh, your progression as a player, how do you feel that, that you have progressed since your first team debut uh, a couple of years ago to how you're feeling now? Uh, yeah, it's went well, but uh, first year or so uh, went better than kind of, not really, not really played since, of uh, a year or so. But uh, hopefully look to, to start in the next few months, a year or so, get back into playing. Been had a wee injury for a while there, but look, looking to get back playing this, so looking forward to it. How would you say that your form's been at the start of the SPSL, uh, SPFL Reserve League season as well? You know, you seem to have uh, started off quite well. Uh, it's been all right. I think we've won most of the games, a few slip ups, but I've been do doing all right. Aye. So I scored a few goals, well, nearly more goals than I scored, scored last year already. So it's been a good start so far. So I hope to can continue and keep trying to score goals, help the team out. How do you feel that? Uh, playing in that sort of environment in the reserve league is going to help you to uh, to continue to progress and to develop to maybe stake a claim for a first team spot. Uh, it's good in the reserve league because there's obviously teams are playing more first team boys doing that. So I think we've played a few teams with like five, six, seven first team boys playing like a lot of experience and national caps and that. So for me, that makes you like almost raise your game, no raise your game, but like. Be a harder task, so gonna like be better if you play against like better players. And I just have to ask you as well. Uh, of course, uh, you've got quite a famous mentor in and uh, in, in Andy Murray. Uh, what what's your relationship like with him and with your uh, agency um, uh, as well? You know what what's what's it like working with them? Uh, good, just keeping contact sometimes. Just gives like some advice in that. So it's good just to have someone like that to like. I kind of talk to you if like something's going well, something's not going well. He can give you advice, and like obviously he's had a good career in his sport, so he can give you like good advice and what you can do better in that as well. So it's good. What's been the best bit of advice that he's given you so far? Uh, just to basically keep keep working hard, keep the head down, and if something's not going well, just keep at it. Because good like good chances and opportunities will come your way if you keep keep working hard.